Hey YouTube, I'm back. Just an update. I have noticed when I hit this a lot of growth in the last, I want to say, month and a half. Uh, reason being because of the products I'm using. I'm still taking hair affinity. Um, it's another video I made of how I do my products. I haven't posted that yet. I'll probably post that before this one, maybe. If not, it'll be after. But anyway, basically all I've been doing after about a month and a half when I was blind with a fade and then I got my second bottle of hair affinity and I started taking them on a consistent basis and I also had some additional products from Hydrothermal Naturals, the follicle mist and the protein leave-in conditioner. I've been using these two daily every day. Basically what I do, I also have the, I spray my whole head massage it in. I also have a growth oil and growth lotion, but I use it at night when I moisturize before I go to bed. And when I go to bed, I come in the house. I don't co wash. I just um, spray my hair with the follicle mist. I take the protein conditioner and I rub that in at night as well. And then I take the growth lotion and put it in my hand, my uh, hair. And then I take the um, the growth oil to seal and put on my satin scar or bonnet. Well, I have the slap cap. Where is that? I have the slap cap. This cap is about $30. I think I got another coupon. So it's already got satin line in it. So sometimes I wear this. I just keep it in the bathroom on the hook. Then, again, Hydrothermal Naturals is a black owned company. Then, this used to be called Coily Kinks. This is called Smooth Natural. This is the hair martini. This can be used as a refresher or a leave in. I spray this on my hair as well. Then, I meant to turn this bottle upside down with the Ultimate Hair Tree, which can be, it's a leave-in moisturizer. It's hard to get out. It's super thick. You see it ain't even moving. It came with a pump, but it's too thick. I love this. And I just rub this all over my head. So I have two leave-ins. A protein balance leave-in. And this is like a moisturizing, thicker leave-in. Because the one from Hydrothermal Naturals is a little watery. But I like it. And then the last thing I use before I let my hair air dry, and again, it's gonna show white, but it, when my hair dries, as it dries, if I see any clumps of white, I just go like this and it goes away. My hair perfection. I love this gel. Again, for me, it's like a mix of using either flaxseed gel, Oh, and I use like two pumps, maybe three. See how runny it is? It's like flax sleep, flax seed gel if you make your own. Or it's like kinky, uh, curly. And I just go like this, I rub it in. Like I said, sometimes we use a little bit more. So I like to make sure all my curls are popping and in place. Again, currently right now, you guys know I changed my hair color. I may or may not right now. Right now, I'm feeling the black. And I'm feeling like the only colors currently right now with my hair being short that I'm liking is the black and the, um, the blonde. all I do and again at night it's the same process I spray the follicle mist the protein conditioner and then I use the uh, growth lotion and growth oil and I'm done that's all I'm doing simple easy I'll do it. Voila, here is the 
There's some white spot. Let me see if I can rub it in. That's all I do as it dries. I see some white spots. Just take my finger, rub it in. It disappears. And I'm done. Talk to you guys later.